ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಪಿಂದಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶ್ಚಕೆ ಪಾಸಿಂದುಭ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವಸ್ಸ ಸ್ನಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂ ಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿಂಗ್ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಭರುಣ್ಯ ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಿಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಯಭವಾದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತಕಮಿ ಗೋಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಕೃಪಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಿಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾಬುದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರೌ ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಹುತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿವ್ಯರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಠಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತ್ವಾಂ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ಬಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಯಶ್ಚಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿಹಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜಿ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
तदेव रम रुचिम नवम नवम तदेव शशतम महोत्सव तदेव शोकर्णवशोषनम यदुत्तम श्लोक यशो अनुगीयते तदेव रम्यम रुचिम नवम नवम तदेव शशतमनसो महोत्सव तदेव शोकर्णवशोषनम यदुत्तम श्लोक यशो अनुगीयते गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री <coughs> शिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर भूपा परमश जगदगुरु टोल्ड व्हेन वी आर गोइंग टू लीव हरि भजन देन वी आर गोइंग टू ओपन वन प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर भूपा परमश जगदगुरु टोल्ड वेन समबॉडी गोइंग टू लीव हरि भजन देन बी श्योर ही इज गोइंग टू ओपन वन प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट हाउ मच प्रॉफिट हाउ मै लॉस दिस अकाउंट ही इज बाउंड टू ओपन इफ समबॉडी कैन नॉट अंडरस्टैंड हरि भजन इट इज स्टील ओके इफ समबॉडी मिस अंडरस्टैंड हरि भजन इट इज मोर एंड मोर डेंजरस यू कैन नॉट रियलाइज वाई आई एम स्पीकिंग दिस वे I am not speaking any personal siddhanta. I am speaking all the siddhanta of Bhakti Vinod Thakur and Pohupat. So, if you become angry, then I can take it as granted. My Hari Katha is successful. That's why you become angry. Otherwise, there is no cause, no reason for why you become angry with my Hari Katha. If you have your honesty, you can come in front of you. You can point out I am speaking something out of Prabhupada and Bhakti Vinod Thakur. What do you suggest? Whom to follow? I can follow you or your organization or your Guru Dev or Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada Bhakti Vinod Thakur. Whom to follow? You come and advise me. Anyway, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada Paramahansa Jagat Guru is Gauriya Goshtipati. He has the anxiousness about the whole sampradaya pure sadhu they have the anxiousness about the whole sampradaya not about this body flesh and blood and pratishtha they are less interested about that they are always interested about sampradayik bani vaibhav if somebody going to make some distort distortion make some wrong siddhanta bisha they are bound to speak If you become angry, it is my request unto your lotus feet. Don't hear that Hari Katha. You, your father, your forefather cannot digest this Hari Katha. So better you don't hear. It is my request. Anyway, Sila Bhopad speaking that if somebody going to leave Hari Bhajan in the preliminary stage, he wanted to take shelter of Guru Dev, wanted to do some say, but after that. Due to his previous sahaja sanskar, he is diverted totally. Is not in the line of Guru Dev, Guru Varga. Totally deviated. So Prabhupada many times told, many times Sila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Jagat Prabhupada, Jagat Guru told, we are neither interested about. private interest nor about public interest we are very much interested about the final satisfaction of supreme lord we are less interested about public interest public amenities public interest or private interest we are only interested about supreme lord Our Hari Katha is not. Our Hari Katha is not to satisfy you. You forget this point. Our Hari Katha is not to satisfy you. Our Hari Katha is to satisfy Supreme Lord. Papa speaking, only a pros can try to satisfy others. A sadhu always try to satisfy Supreme Lord. This is the point. 
This way we are always interested about the complete satisfaction of Supreme Lord. We are not going to give any importance to your public interest or private interest. We are less interested about that. We are not going to speak anything about that. Anyway, today is the <coughs> appearance day. Appearance when Bhagavan Avirbhav Tithi of Bhagavan Sri Krishna. Bhagavan appearing in this material world. Why? To give us the scope of seva. Bhagavan appeared in this material world to give us the scope of seva. Nothing else. If Bhagavan is not going to give us seva, then we cannot do seva. If Bhagavan is not going to give us seva in the form of vigraha or directly, some devotees they are serving Bhagavan directly, like Madhavendra Puripaj Adi, mentally they are serving. They can see Bhagavan. So before serving Supreme Lord or before serving his devotees, first of all we must understand their mood, their Aprakita Sarup, without understanding the Aprakita Sarup of Bhagavan, without understanding the Aprakita Sarup of devotees, pure devotees, I cannot serve. Object of my service, I should realize the object of my service in what position is his position what i should realize it first what is the position of that object of my service i must realize so without realizing the sarup of without realizing the sarup of that you know vigraha sheb 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 i know Shebba Vigraha, I cannot serve. It's not possible. If I can serve, if I can serve fancifully, if I am going to cut the link with Guru Bhargava, then it is not safe. If I am going to, if I am interested to protect my Pratishtha, I am going to cut the link with Guru Bhargava, in that case it is not seva. It is not seva, it is not actually seva. That is why Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking in Bhagavad Gita. That is why Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking in Bhagavad Gita. Jo Shastra Vidim Utsrijya Kama Charata Bartate No Sasidhim. No sukham na param gutim. Apnati no siddhim na sukham na param gutim. Jo sastra vidhim usridya bartate kama charata. If somebody is going to avoid the scriptural instruction, authentic scriptural instruction, if somebody is going to avoid shouta parampara, knowledge, in that case he cannot do seva. He cannot get any transcendental bliss, he cannot get any siddhi, na param gatim. After leaving this body, he cannot get param gati, paramane absolute gati, cannot get. That is the main problem. In Narad Pancharatra also it is written there. 
Suti, Siti, Puran, Adi, Pancharatni, Bidhing, Bina, Oikanti, Harir, Bhakti, Utpatai, Vakalpati. Suti, Siti, Puran, Adi, Pancharatni, Bidhing, Bina, Oikanti, Harir, Bhakti, Utpatai, Vakalpati. If you want to prove that you are doing absolute bhajan, Rupanu Gopajan, Ragajan, you can do it. I have no objection. I am also in favor of Rupanu Gopajan, Raganu Gopajan. I am not against. Popa speaking, I am not against Rupanu Gopajan. I am interested. You can remember when Prabhupada speaking Harikatha in Radha Kundo, some Saujiya went to attack him. Baba speaking, don't go there, there are Sahaja, come here. You can get lost. Then they become very angry, they say, you are Sahaja, why you are speaking, we are Sahaja? Baba saying, yes, we are Sahaja. Really, we are Sahaja. Because all Sahaja Dharma, all Sahaja Dharma of that transcendental world, Golokdam Vrindavan, it is there with us. But you are, we are a Prakita Sahaja, you are Prakita Sahaja. You are Prakito material Sahajiya. We are Sahajiya, but we are Prakito Sahajiya. We want to keep, keep link with our Prakito Jagat. <coughs> so, Hari Bhajan, personally, according to my desire, I cannot start Hari Bhajan. According to my, according to my desire, I cannot do Hari Bhajan. Harivajan is not possible, according to my desire. If I am going to do bhajan some completely separately, in that case, it is not at all seva. It is not at all seva. Seva means I will have to seek the satisfaction of that Supreme Lord or object of my service. So, in Narad Pancharatra also it is written, Sruti, Siti, Puran, Adi, Pancharatni, Bidhing, Bina, Vaikanti, Harir, Bhakti, Utpat, Iva, Kalvati. It is called actually Utpat. Utpat means disturbance. It is one kind of disturbance in the way of our Sampradaya. It is one kind of disturbance. You are making one kind of disturbance in the way of our Hari Bhajan, actually, Parampara line. Common people, they, they are less interested about actual Hari Bhajan. That's why they become angry. Otherwise, there is no scope. Anyway, I can give one or two examples to you, so that you can realize. When Choto Haridas going to carry one packet of rice up to Madhavadivi Dasi, Alalna from Puri, and from there he is going to carry one fine rice by the order of Bhagavan Das. Bhagavan Das, Babaji Maharaj, is going to carry that rice from there for the, for the Seva of Siman Mahaprabhu. So, Mahaprabhu is going to take prasadam. Be careful. Mahaprabhu is going to take prasadam because Bhagavan does already cook and offer everything ready. It is already offered to Bhagavan. And Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself is also Bhagavan Sri Krishna. He is going to take prasadam and going to appreciate very nice rice. Where from you are bringing? From Bhagavan Das speaking, I am bringing from from that, you know, Madhavi Devi Dasi. Who bring it? Then, Bhagavan Das speaking, actually, our Choto Haridas bring it. Mahapu keep silence, don't speak anything. After taking prasadam, going to room and giving order to Govinda, from today onward, you don't allow Chhoto Haridas to enter here. It's totally prohibited. 
you don't allow Chhoto Haridas to enter in this Gambira Mandir. Don't allow him to come in front of me. Darshan is totally prohibited. Totally prohibited. His darshan is totally prohibited. This way, actually, nobody can understand what, what problem happened. Finally, those devotees, they could realize something happened. Something happened. Our Prabhupada wanted to clarify this point. Before Krishna Bhajan, before Rupanuga Bhajan, Raganuga Bhajan, we should realize this point. Pure devotees, they could realize something happened. Mahaprabhu is not going to clarify. Papa speaking, when Chotohridas went there in the house of Madhavi Devi Dasi to collect rice from there, in that case, Madhavi Devi Dasi is very aged lady, very old. Even we can count the name of Madhavi Desi Dasi among all internal associates. So how possible that Chhotori is going there feeling some reaction? There was one young Mataji. She was serving Chhotori. Uh, she was serving Madhavi Devi Dasi, and Chhotori Das. Feeling something, not speaking anything. Feeling something inside. Mahaprabhu, I mean Bhagavan Sri Krishna sitting inside heart. Immediately he could realize. So Mahaprabhu speaking, I am not under my control. I cannot allow any man who is in renounce order, any renunciate, can do some babichar, Wrong activity directly or indirectly, I mean inside heart. So, reaction of that man, try to understand Hari Bhajan. So, the reaction, the man going to carry the rice, Mahaprabhu taking prasadam. So, in very subtle form, the Baba translated into rice. He is not going to cook anything. He is not going to cook anything. He is going to carry. So by the touch of his hand, rice, Mahaprabhu could realize. That's why Mahaprabhu told to Hari, told to Sri Raghunath Das Goswami, Vishoyir Anno Khaile Molin Hoi Mon. Vishoyir Anno Khaile Moli Nuhaymon, who is material man, those who are material man, if you are going to accept something from him, take Vishoyir Anno Khaile, material man. Some rich man sometimes giving rice, dal to, you know, sannyasi, so their brain become contaminated, they cannot understand. Their brain become contaminated, they cannot understand Hari Bhajan. Before passing any remark, before passing any remark, you must stand on a neutral platform. Before passing any remark, you must stand on a neutral platform. Then you can understand what Prabhupada speaking, Bhakti Thakur speaking, this is. Otherwise, it is impossible to understand this point. So, to avoid any disturbance, our Guru Bhargu arranged some specific you know, line is called Guru Parampara, I mean Bhagavad Parampara. They wanted to protect. They wanted to give protection to Siddhanta Vani, everything. That's why they wanted to arrange this way. Actually, Krishna Bhajan is not possible for bonded soul. For bonded soul, Krishna Bhajan is not possible. Because Krishna First of all, in starting, I told, you will have to understand the position of Krishna and devotees of Krishna. If you are failure to realize the position of Krishna, how you can serve? They realize everything inside your heart. So, common people usually cannot serve 
Krishna is possible. But under the guidance of pure Guru Vaishnava, they, they can go on practicing and finally they can utter pure Harinam. They can go on chanting the mantra they are getting Kam Gayatri, Kam Bij. Kam Gayatri, Kam Bij they can get. By the help of Kam Gayatri, Kam Bij, somebody can worship Krishna. Of course, you will have to go up to that level. Kam Gayatri, Kam Bij. Kam Gayatri, Kam Bij. If you can, by the help of Kam Gayatri, Kam Bij, one can worship Krishna. Otherwise, it is not possible to worship. In Chaitanya Charitamrita, it is written, Kam Gayatri Kam Bije Jar Aradhan. Bhagavan going to appear in this material world. And in infinity Brahmanda, everywhere Bhagavan doing some kind of Leela. This, this Brahmanda, next. So many countless Brahmanda, they are Bhagavan going to do, do different kind of Leela. So today, this, in this Brahmanda, where we are living, Bhagavan is going to appear in this Brahmanda today. But actually, Abhirbhav Leela is eternal, eternally going on. Abhirbhav Leela of Bhagavan continuously in different Brahmanda, different kind of Leela going on, but Abhirbhav Leela also eternal. Because in different, different Brahmanda, where Abhirbhav Leela going on, who knows? So, every fraction of second, every Leela is eternal. Srila Prabhupada speaking, the deities of Bhagavan, our Guru Varga, going to engage us in the service of Bhagavan, in the form of deities. We are going to worship Bhagavan in the form of deities. So, Vigraha Naho Tumi Shakshat Brajendra Nandan. You are not actually deities, you are Supreme Lord Himself. From Chaitanya Charitamrita, we have evidence, many such evidence. Many such evidence. In Chaitanya Charitamrita, small vipro, choto vipro, and baro vipro. Choto vipro and baro vipro. Choto vipro and baro vipro. You know the case, I am not going in details. When choto vipro going in Vrindavan to invite Bhagavan, when Chota Vipro going to Sri Vindavan to invite Bhagavan, you will have to go with me because you are witness. You are the witness, so you will have to go with me. Please, you will have to go. You are the witness. Bhagavan speaking, Bigraha going, we never hear anything. You can arrange the assembly and there I can appear and speak. A voice, everybody can hear my voice. But physically it is not possible for me to hear because there is where it is written that Bigraha can move. Then Choto Bipro speaking, Bigro can speak. So Bigro can walk also. Bibro in the form of Bigraha, you are speaking. So in the form of Bigro you can also walk. So we'll have to go there, please. Then Chotobipro, by the invitation of Chotobipro, Bhagavan now coming up to Shakshi Gopal, you know, South India. After that, it was installed there. This way we know Bigraha and Bhagavan all the same. So, Prabhupada speaking in the form of Bigraha. The name Bigraha means, Bigraha means to bestow kipa on us. Bigraha, Bigraha means B, means B, means B, special, eh? Anugraha. Specially, Bhagavan is going to give us some speciality, speciality to serve. What is a speciality? Bhagavan cannot speak, I don't like it. Because he is in the form of Bigraha. 
in the form of vigraha bhagwan not going to speak i don't like it don't don't give it to me i like this you give to me bhagwan cannot speak there is a speciality so this way bhagwan in the form of deities can come in front of us by the mercy of guru barga but we must be very careful while serving well we are going to serve bhagwan we must be very careful because we will have to realize each and every point what bhagwan likes what bhagwan not approve what going to approve all everything will have to as per simad bhagwan ji mahapuran we find that today night time actually 12 o'clock bhagwan because sri ramchandra sri ramchandra took birth sri ramchandra took birth i mean appeared noon time 12 o'clock 12 o'clock ramchandra took birth and sun god is there that time sun god is there in the hay on our head sun god is not moving moon god crying if he is not moving how i can take darshan of ram but sun god not moving some god fix how i like to see the lotus feet of ram chandra then bhagwan assure you know going to give assurance to chandrama the i can appear because in the destiny of surya bamsa in surya bamsa in surya bamsa bhagwan ramchandra took birth and bhagwan sri krishna appeared in the destiny of chandra bamsa in whole bhagavatam you can find a detailed explanation of surya bamsa i mean hereditical and a king everything you can find surya bamsa and chandra bamsa both hereditical bhagwan krishna chandra took birth in the in a heritage of a chandra bamsa chandra bamsa and bhagwan sri krishna uh, ramchandra took birth in surya bamsa there is the point so as per the assurance of bhagwan bhagwan as per the assurance of bhagwan bhagwan going to appear in night time 12 o'clock in in mathura inside mathura mathura is gan bhumika our prabhupad going to explain mathura is the platform of a prakito gan gan bhumika when you are standing on gan bhumika you cannot get facility to serve bhagwan from heart because gan going to backing you na gyan bhumika it is a platform of knowledge pure knowledge and transcendental knowledge so mathura is gyan bhumika and vasudev ji maharaj ji shuddha satto vasudev ji maharaj ji shuddha satto vasudev ji maharaj ji shuddha satto they are bhagwan going to appear not like ordinary boy ordinary boy taking birth from the womb of mother but this is this kind of birth is the bhagwan boy bhagwan going to appear this is not like that it totally separate janma karma cha me divyam janma karma cha me divyam jo vyakti tatto takta deham punar janma naithi mamit saharjuno त्यक्ता देहम पुनर्जन्म नहीं थी मामे तो सारियों इन व्हाट यू फाइंड इन गीता इन समय भागवत गीता भगवान स्पीकिंग माय जन्म कर्म इस दिव्यो माय जन्म कर्म इस दिव्यो दिव्यो मीन यू कैन मीन ट्रांसेंडेंटल you can mean transcendental but if i ask you one question when arjun when arjun is a eternal person of bhagwan 
when Arjun always playing, always, always traveling with Bhagavan, Bhagavan Krishna, always eating, taking pusa, everything, all together, sleeping together. So, do you think the darshan of Arjun was very material? Do you think the darshan of Arjun was material? How possible? Arjun is the friend of Krishna. So, if Arjun is the friend of Krishna, accordingly, his darshan is also pure darshan. Then why in Srimad Bhagavad Gita it is written, Arjun, by your, these eyes is not sufficient. Your, these two eyes is not sufficient to look my aprakita vaibhav, I mean, Vishya Roop, you know, Vishya Roop, you know, Vishya Roop. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Arjun, Arjun, by your, this, by the help of these two eyes, you cannot see me. So I am going to give you Dibba Chakshu. I am going to give you Dibba Chakshu. So he, here, what is the meaning of this Dibba Chakshu? What is the meaning of this Dibba Chakshu mean? We know, transcendental. So what do you mean? The darshan of Arjun was totally dirty darshan, material darshan. It is not possible. But Gita Pravachan was possible only by the mercy of Bhagavan. By the mercy of Bhagavan, it was possible for us to hear O oh, whole Srimad Bhagavad Gita. Because Arjun putting question, Arjun is as if, as if Arjun, as if Arjun is standing on a, a separate platform, like an ordinary man. Arjun asking so many questions. Arjun asking so many questions. So it seems the Arjun is now ignorant. The Arjun is not knowledgeable personality. If Arjun at all not going to stand on this platform, how we can hear Bhagavad Gita? Because Arjun putting question, that's why Bhagavan giving answer, that's why we hear. Full. Otherwise, how it is possible? It would not have been possible for us to hear Bhagavad Gita. So now in this case, when Bhagavan speaking, I am going to give you Dibba Chakshu. By the help of these two eyes, you cannot see my, uh, you know, Bisha Rup. So, Vishwanath Chakotiva speaking, Baladev Vidyabhasana speaking. That doesn't mean Arjun, as Abbe, Arjun have material darshan. That doesn't mean. That doesn't mean Arjun having material darshan. Then what is the meaning? The Vishwanath Chakotiva speaking, Arjun is having sweet, sweet darshan. Friendship, na? With Bhagavan, a sweet darshan. Arjun is not habituated to see this kind of appliances. That's why, Bhagavan speaking, I like to give you some special darshan power. That's why, Bhagavan speaking, I like to give you some special darshan power by the help of which you can see everything. My Vishwaru. Because to see Vishwaru, your this darshan capacity is not so because you are habituated to, to see me as a friend. Very sweet relation with me. Arjun also going to confess. I have a nice relation with you as a friend. I couldn't realize. So, sometimes I am speaking heavy to you. Sometimes joking with you. Sometimes sleeping with you. So, never mind. It's called Dibba Darshan. Here, actually, when Bhagavan speaking in Srimad Bhagavad Gita. Janma karma chame divyam jo beti tattato. On my janma abhirbha and karma, what I am doing. Janma abhirbha and what I am doing after taking birth, what all I am taking. 
even when Bhagavan disappears from this material world, it is also have some inner meaning. So much confusion among people. So, Janma Karma Chame Divya, Janma Karma Janma Karma Chame Divya, Jo Bhakti Tattato. After that, Bhagavan speaking. If somebody can realize my aprakita janma karma, if somebody can realize my aprakita janma karma, then he need not take birth again on this material world. Takta ajeham punar janma noiti mamiti swarjuna. Arjuna, he need not take birth again. Because if he can realize aprakita avirbhava Bhagavan, then it is okay. If we can realize Aprakita Avirbhava Janma Karma, if, if somebody can realize Janma and Karma, Avirbhav and all Leelas of Bhagavan, that's mean that's mean everything done. Can realize Avirbhav, can realize all the Leelas of Bhagavan, then everything, all problems solved. Leela, if somebody understands Leela, that means everything done. Then he can enter into eternal dham. He need not take birth. Because so gradual, you know, step by step, different kind of discussion I am doing in Bhagavad Gita. In Bhagavad Gita. Anyway, so, when Brahma and all demigods, when Brahma and all demigods, they are together, when they are going to request Bhagavan, try to understand. When Bhagavan, uh, when Brahma and all demigods, they are going to request Bhagavan and going to reach the bank of Kiradoka Sai Vishnu, Aniruddha Vishnu, Kiradoka Sai, Kir Sagar, Kira Sagar. Brahma and all demigods, they are going to request Bhagavan. There is too much. Prithibi Devi, all the art, I mean Prithibi Devi, no? Prithibi Devi. Prithibi, this art. Devi, Prithibi Devi. Dharti Ma. In Bengali, we say Dharti Ma. Prithibi Devi. She also going. All the together going. All. In group, they are going to request Bhagavan. They are going to request Bhagavan at the bank of Kirsagar. At the bank of Kirsagar, they are speaking. They cannot see. Brahma cannot see where is Bhagavan. Those demigods, they cannot see where is Bhagavan. But they are praying. Brahma praying by the help of Purusha Sukta Mantra. Om Sahasra Sissa Sahasra. This mantra. By the help of, by the help of this, you know, mantra, I mean this Purusha Sukta mantra, Brahma going to worship Bhagavan. But still, Brahma cannot see. Brahma cannot see. Only hear some aerial voice. By the worship of Brahma, by the request of Brahma, by the prayer of Brahma, and all demigods, Bhagavan was satisfied. So, some aerial voice. Aerial voice only. Even Brahma cannot see what is happening, who is speaking. Sankar also going. Brahma, Sankar, Indra, Varun, all they are going. But they, no, nobody can. They cannot see. They cannot see anything. Only they hear some aerial voice. Sahasro Badano Sarat Bhavita. A Bhagavan. Bhagavan Anantadev. Bhagavan Anantadev can appear fast. Bhagavan Anantadev can appear fast. After that, Bhagavan can come. 
After that, Bhagavan can go on before that. So, Anantadev, Shankarshan coming fast, appear in the womb of Devakima. After that, six months over, seven months, no, six, seven months. After that, that Garva was transferred into the womb of Rohinima. The Garva was transferred into the womb of Rohinima first. There actually Balaji Maharaj, you know, taking birth. Yes, usually after twelve months. Usually I know. No, uh, nine months. Huh? Nine months. Nine months actually. So now actually, Balaji Maharaj was transferred in the womb of, you know, uh, Rohinima. After that, in the meantime, Bhagavan also, as per previous commitment, Bhagavan going to appear in the heart of Vasudevji Maharaj. Bhagavan going to appear into the heart of Vasudevji Maharaj first. Not like ordinary human being. First going to appear into the heart of into the heart of Vasudevji Maharaj. And from there going to enter into into the body of Devakima. It is written. First of all, appear into the heart of Vasudevji Maharaj. From there, the Teja power going to appear into the heart of, into the body of Devukima. And by watching the effulgence and power of Devuki, Devukima, Kongso could realize, Kongso could realize, oh, this must be. So, so many cases I can speak something due to disturbance. I wanted to speak so many things. They are doing some offense, you know. They don't know Harikatha. What is Harikatha? They don't realize. Material man. That's why they make offense. They don't, don't know how Harikatha appear inside heart. After that. They think material thing. Like they are material activities. So anyway, first of all, one by one, one by one, one by one, one one baby taking birth from the womb of, you know, Devoki and Kongso going to, you know, destroy. Kongso going to destroy. So when the first baby appeared, there is long history, long Siddhanta Bishar actually. First of all, six boys of Kalnemi. Follow? Six boys. They ap appear. So long history. You have to go Satya Juk, so many. So six boys first. There is a mystery of six boys, all consecutively, one by one, six boys taking birth. There is some secret Siddhanta. Those six boys are the son of, of Kalnemi. When Kongso was there in the form of Kalnemi, that time. Follow. Kalnemi. So, now, Six boys, one by one, going to die. Eh? First of all, when the first boy took birth, first boy took birth, then Kongso going to destroy. Kongso want to destroy. Bhasudevji Maharaj, Bhasudevji Maharaj going to give some, you know, give some consolation to Kongso. Give some argument. 
you going to kill this your daughter, your sister? You going to kill your sister? This is not good. Because everybody can criticize you. Actually, problem is there with the Ashtam Garbha, eighth, eighth Garbha. Number eight issue. Problem is there with number eight, number eight issue, not this issue. Number eight number issue. This is the problem. Number eight number issue. So why you are going to kill? I can promise you. I can promise you that uh, no, one by one, I already promise you, one by one, if, if those who are you know, taking birth, any baby, I can hand over to you. I can hand over to you, you can do whatever you like. After that, Kangsho was convinced by Vasudevji Maharaj. Okay, problem is there with the eighth issue. So why should I kill? <coughs> why should I kill? Because everybody can criticize me as a merciless going to kill all small babies. <coughs> so better I can hand over this boy to to Basudev. Okay, you can take. Because Basudev never going to speak lie. Kongso knows Kongso knows it very well. Kongso knows it very well that Basudev never speaking any lie. So he is, he, is, he is very much convinced. <coughs> okay, you can take. He was taken away. <coughs> then in the meantime, Vasudev, when Kongsa is speaking, well, you can take this baby away. No problem, you can take it. This baby, no problem. Then when Vasudevji Maharaj going back, step by step, Vasudevji Maharaj think, thinking, the, I cannot believe Kangsa. Those who are dirty heart, they can do anything. <coughs> Those who are dirty heart, they can do anything. King Duswamnu Sadhunam, Vidusham Kim Apekshitam, Kim Akarjam Kadarjanam, Dustajam Kim Dhitatmanam. Four thing. King Duswamnu Sadhunam. A sadhu can tolerate everything. A sadhu can tolerate everything. There is no extreme point. A sadhu can tolerate everything <coughs> by the power of Supreme Lord. Kim Duswamnu Sadhunam. What a sadhu cannot tolerate. Vidusham kim apekshitam. Vidusham, vidushi, two words. One is vidusham min, vidusham min those who are learned, pandit, uh, uh, those who are of practice of gyan, they are not going to depend upon anybody. They are not depend on you. They are going not going, they know Bhagavan is there. Madhubandhi Prabhupada not going to collect money from foreign country to make the big festival. Automatically done. Madhubandhi is not going to collect anything. Automatically they are doing. So, Kim Dushwamnu Sadhu Nam, a sadhu can tolerate everything, anything and everything. Vidusham Kim Apekshitam. Those who are learned man, learned mean those who are actual pandit. Pandit mean those who are having the knowledge of those who are having the knowledge of matter and antimatter, prakit and of prakit, matter and antimatter, prakit of prakit. They have no knowledge. They under they can realize this is bondage. This is bondage. Don't go there. Can go there. This is. Pandito Bandha Mokshavit. Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking to Uddhavji Maharaj. Uddhavji Maharaj, who is Pandit Prabhu? Who 
who has some proficiency, you can speak Sanskrit, is Pandit? No. Bhagavan Sri Krishna, Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, Pandito Bandha Makshabit. Pandito Bandha Makshabit. He is actually Pandit. Who understand this kind of my activities can put me into danger, bondage. And if I go this way, I can become free. Because at all, if you are not free, how you can do Krishna Bhajan? Mukta Kulei Rupashamanam. Every day you are, before chanting or speaking. Mukta Kulei Rupashamanam. Mukta Kulmane, those who are totally free. Bhagavan can be worshipped by them, not by bonded soul. Follow what I say. Mukta Kulei Rupashamanam means. Those are mukta kul. Bhagavan can be worshipped by them. Bonded soul they cannot worship. But don't worry. We can believe Bhakti Mir Thakur, Pahupad. So we can get power. But don't become angry when I am speaking the Siddhanta of Pahupad and Bhakti Mir Thakur. Because if you become angry with me, that means you are defeated. If somebody become angry, then he is defeated. Suppose discussion going on, na? suppose I am giving some, you know, you are sitting in front of me, you are putting question, and I am giving answer. Sometimes I am putting question, you give me. When I put question in front of you, you become very, very angry. That means you are defeated. Scriptural discussion going on, if you become angry, that means you are defeated. That means you are very aware. You, you are very aware about the fact that Maharaj speaking about Bhakti Mithakur and Prabhupada. Maharaj is not going to speak anything out of Prabhupada and Bhakti Mithakur. That's why. Is the evidence you become angry because you can realize Maharaj is not going to follow us. We are Sahajiya. That's why I become angry. Otherwise, there is no reason. Your angry attitude can prove that Bhakti Thakur, Prabhupada, Keshav Goswami Maharaj, you know, our Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, their preaching is perfect. That's why you become angry. You cannot tolerate the absolute truth. You cannot digest. So you see, Pandito Vandha Mokshavit. Those who are having full idea, conception, knowledge about this is bondage and this way if I run, I can become, become free from material torture. Because Bhagavan cannot be worshipped by bonded soul. Bhagavan cannot be worshipped by bonded soul. So Bhagavan says, Mukta Kuli Rupasamanam Parishasam Harinam Sangsayam. Follow. This way, Mukta Kulir Basman. So, King Dushaham Nu Shadhunam, I already explained. Vidusham Kim Apekshitam, those who are Vidusha, <coughs> Vidusha is knowledgeable person. Dibba Gyan, those who are. They are not going to depend upon anyone. They know all, everything can be arranged by Bhagavan. Kim Dushwam Nu Sadhunam, Vidusham Kim Apekshitam. Kim Akaryam Kadar Jyanam. There are so many questions. Vasudevji Maharaj thinking that he is a dirty soul. He can do anything, anytime. I cannot believe him. Now going to speak me, okay, you can take your children, I mean, you can take this baby, away from me, uh, no problem, I cannot believe. But any time he can change his rima. That's why many time Prabhupada used to say, only and only you can believe, only and only, only and only you can believe pure Guru Vishnu. Not your father, not your mother, not your brother, not your grandfather, nobody. Maybe his age is 90 years, still you cannot believe. Anytime they can do some opposite. They are bonded so. Prabhupada speaking, only and only we can believe 
are pure devotees. Who is pure devotees? Who is pure devotees? Who is totally established in our Guru Parampara. If he is not at all established in Guru Parampara, he can preach all over the world. But there is not actual effective preaching you cannot get. <coughs> Kim Akaryam, you know, those who are dirty, you know, like Kamsa. Kim Duswamnu Sadhunam, Vidusham Kim Apekshitam, Kim Akaryam Kadar Janam. Dustajam Kim Dhitatmanam. Dustajam Kim Dhitatmanam. Dustajam means? Nothing there with Guru Vishnu, pure Guru Vishnu, nothing there, such a thing. If they can lament for, if somebody take away, if somebody take away, all gone from the life. All, everything gone from life. But still they are not going to lament. Dustajam ki dhidadana. Hello. This way, Naraji Maharaj one day coming. Naraji Maharaj one day coming. When Basudevji Maharaj and Kongso going to make some agreement. Agreement, no? Because number eight son can make problem. So unnecessarily I cannot kill. So better you can take. But our Naraji Maharaj thinking, we Naraji Maharaj thinking this way, this way. Kongso not going to die quickly. We cannot destroy Kongso very quickly. If Kongso makes some problem, aparad, offense, then quickly he can die. But the agreement, you know, done between this big problem. So Naraji Maharaj coming and speaking. How you are? Naraji Maharaj coming and Kongso giving cheer. Nice seat. So Naraji Maharaj sitting and Naraji Maharaj asking how you are. What is the news? Then everything is speaking, all in details. Well, this kind of problem is there. I give back all the first children, first baby, first baby took, I give away. So Naraji Maharaj speaking, be careful. In course of my traveling, in course of my traveling, I went to there Sumeru Parvat. Sumeru. Sumeru Parvat means going to, you know, when sun going that side, there is one hill, Sumeru Parvat. In Bhagavatam you can get. I make the partition. So, Nindo Naraji Maharaj speaking, I went there in Sumeru Parvat, those demigods, they are, they are, they are, uh, they are, uh, they are uh, you know, one assembly. They are making some meeting. There is some meeting going on. There is some meeting going on. All demigods, they are sitting together. They are making some meeting. And uh, I like to inform you some secret thing. Uh, the demigods, they like to, you know, destroy you. Demigod, they are planning how to destroy you. So don't believe anybody. Don't believe anybody. Vasudev Adi, they are not ordinary men. They are not ordinary. They are coming to some purpose, secret purpose there. So better you don't believe anybody. Because number, number eight song, what is the guarantee? Because Jimmy God, they are very clever. If they count one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, then it's okay. But if they count, count down, you know, count down. I mean, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Then the number one is number eight. Yes, can be so. Naraji is giving, you know, this kind of one to convince, so that he can do some sinful activities. Aparat and get destroyed very quickly. So Naraji Mahasu, don't believe them. What is the guarantee? If one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, if you count, 
They are very clever. Maybe they are counting wrong, just opposite way. Eight, seven, you know, six, five, four, three, two, one. In that case, number one is danger. Oh, really? So, then Kong is going to take the baby from the lap of Debuki and going to throw on the stone. This we are going to kill. Six boys, six boys are going to die. Six boys all going to die. After that, what happened? Seventh Garva, seventh who is Anantadev? Seventh ke who? Sankarsan Anantadev? Seventh is Anantadev. So, first of all, Anantadev coming as the aerial voice, as per the aerial voice. Vasudeva Kala Ananta. Vasudeva eh? Kala Ananta. Vasudeva Kala Ananta Bhagavan. Sarat, he is Sarat, he is also Supreme Lord. Bhagavan. Krishna Balaram, same almost. But still there is difference. Then Balaji Maharaj actually you know, was transferred, I already tell. They have in the meantime, Balaji Maharaj, you know, going to take birth. Balaji Maharaj going to take birth. Here in the from the womb. And there actually, Krishna Bhagavan going to take birth very quickly. We don't understand what I say. When seventh month going to touch, then the womb was tougher. So after that, Krishna took birth in twelve month. Follow. And Krishna took birth very quickly. Balaji Maharaj took another five months. Seven months going to touch, six months gone, another six months. And our Krishna Bhagavan going to take birth very quickly. Very quickly. So, Krishna and Balaram, Abhirbhak Titi, you can count in as per Vaishnava calendar. Somebody there in Vrindavan, they are fighting. That, that Balaji Mara took birth one year before. One year before. But as per calculation, it is not that. So this way, according to the calculation of Kangsa, Kangsa couldn't be here. So he wanted to kill one by one all babies. After that, you know, seventh, you know, yeah, after that. And in Gopal Champu and in other Puran also you can find. In, in Srimad Bhagavatam it is written, that at a time, at a time, at the, and at a time and the same time, here in Mathura, Krishna appeared in the night, night time, and there also in the night time, where in Gokul, here Devokima, there, there is actually our Jasudama. Both of them at a time going to, you know, give birth. But some speciality there actually not like ordinary birth. But actually about Yashodama something special written. Here actually in you know, in the jail, because finally I am not going to discuss all in detail. There in the jail in of Kansa, Mathura. Mathura, when Krishna appeared in the form of Narayan, Vasudeva, you know, in the form. Shankar Chakra Gadapadma is born. In that case, Vasudevji and Daivaki, they started praying in front of, they started praying in front of Bhagavan. He appeared in the form of, you know, in Shankar Chakra Gadapadma. Who can believe that you you are our son? Also big problem because Sankar Chakra a baby, <laughs> how possible? In that case, Bhagavan speaking, 
First of all, I appear in this form. First of all, I appear in this form because otherwise you cannot remember. Prishni Garbha. Prishni Garbha. Dhara, I know. Prishni Garbha, it is called you know, Prishni Garbha. You know. uh, dhara or Drona. Drona and Dhara is actually Nando. Nanda Baba and Vasudev, eh, Nanda Baba and Jasudama. Uh, here is Prishni, Prishni Garva. They mean actually Sutapa and uh, I forget the name. Anyway, two in the form. So Bhagavan speaking, previously all thousands of years, we are doing bhajan. He wanted to get a son like me. He wanted to get a son like me, but a son like me is not possible. A son like me is not at all possible. So I am bound to come in this form to remind you because this, you know, uh, what name that? Uh, Dith, uh, Aditi, Aditi Ma and Kasha. They are also Bhagavan singing, I came in this form as a, a, a son, but you cannot remember. So that you can remember, so I came in the form of four, and you know, this way, actually. So after that, as per the request of Devuki Ma and our Vasudev, Bhagavan taking the form of baby small and in the lap then they forget the past so long as they are going to remember about the appliances of bhagavan they cannot laugh how it is possible to take the baby and kiss bhagavan they can think this way so this kind of conception that is bhagavan if this kind of conception there then surely Vasudev and Devoki cannot take the boy in lap. That's why by the magic spell of Yogamaya, they forget everything. Now they are taking the baby in lap and kissing this way. After that what happened? Bhagavan already speaking, if you feel some problem, if you are feeling anxiety, so why not you transform me to Gokul? Bhagavan giving advice to Vasudev Daivaki, if you are feeling some tension, so you can transform me to Gokul there in the house of Nanda Baba. By the advice of you know Bhagavan, Vasudev Ji, night time going to cross the river automatically. The lock and key, the jail is you know, there are lock and key, the jail open and all the chain there in the hand and leg all open automatically. Then Vasudevji taking the baby on lap, going outside, automatically, going outside, going to cross the river, Jamuna. Jamuna was very powerful that time, night time, drizzling, rain coming. So. Vasudev Ji Ananta going to protect the rain and, and a thunderbolt. All. Ananta Dev. But Vasudev Ji Maharaj cannot see. Backside, Ananta Dev there. He's taking the baby on lap. After that, going to cross the river Jamuna and going to reach, going to reach Gokul. Going to reach Gokul. I already told in Gopal Champu, and in Bhagavatam or other document, at a time, same time, Rohinima, our you know, is going to give birth to one baby, and the procedure I already told. First of all, Bhagavan appeared in the world, not like ordinary, you know, issue. And there also about about uh, about our. Uh, Jasodama, 
something written special. Jashodama cannot remember. Jashodama was so tired, she couldn't realize boy, boy baby or girl baby too. In the written was she was so tired, she could not realize. So in the meantime, what happens? Jiva Goswami by writing in Gopal Champu, there actually one girl and one boy. Boy is Krishna. Bhagavatam in many places in Shastra it is written, Nandatmaja. There we say na Jasuda Nandan, Nanda Nandan. Eh? Jasuda Nandan we speak. Nanda Nandan we speak. So Sachinandan we speak. Eh? So actually there our Yasudama was you know unconscious, feeling trouble, weak, very weak, could not realize. So there it is written at the same time there one boy and one girl. Both took birth. And here already I told in in the jail of Tangsa, they took birth. So when our so when our Vasudevji Maharaj going to Gokul. Because Bhagavan speaking, you can if you fear, then you can do one thing. You can go there, put this boy baby there. There is one girl baby. You can take there from there. So as for the instruction, our Vasudevji Maharaj crossing the Jamuna River, that side of Jamuna River is Gokul. Long distance, 18 kilometers you will have to. But it is possible for them. So reaching that place and going to keep the boy baby, you know, boy baby there, and taking the girl baby from there. In the meantime, what happened? It is the arrangement of Jogmaya. Vasudevji Maharaj could not identify there is one boy also. Couldn't see. Only he could see the girl baby. When you're going to keep this boy baby there in the bed and going to uh, get the girl baby, in the meantime, that Nandanandan Krishna and this Vasudev Nandan went to submerge with each other. Going to submerge with each other, so now nobody can understand. This way, Jogama, uh, this way that girl baby was taken back, taken back into the jail. So, so when there is a girl baby with a girl baby in a, in a lap going to enter the jail, in that case, like previously, same. There is a barrier in the hand, leg, or barrier, as it is. Because otherwise, Kongsu can express some doubt, no? So automatically, going to express. And the jail is also become under lock and key. But when the baby is shouting, baby girl, baby shouting, wah, wah. In the meantime, the, the jail, I mean those who are in a gate, gate man, going to inform council. Inform council immediately. This was the instruction of council. Council, Give them any Anytime any baby take birth, immediately inform me. So when the you know they are inside the jail, when they are hearing the sound of girl, you know baby, they, that that they are going to run there to inform, to inform Kangsa that some baby already took birth. Then Kangsa, Kangsa just get up from bed because he was very fearful and without controlling even the you know hair hair of a head cloth cloth already opening is running to catch that baby because he is a full tension full tension big you know was running there 
and open the jail and going to take the baby from the lab. Devagumi are crying, oh my brother, it's girl baby. There's no problem. Why you are going to kill? At least you can give one girl. You kill all, you know, all my children you kill. At least you give, I beg. Kongso was so mercy, you know, merciless, going to snatch the girl from the lap of sister, I mean, Devoki. And going to throw in the stone. When going to throw in the stone, that the baby slipped from the hand of Kansa. Wanted to catch and throw, but by chance slipped, slipped from the hand of Kansa. Going up and taking eight, eight hands, going to sow. Why you are unnecessary foolish, you are going to kill me? Foolish, you are going to kill me unnecessarily. <laughs> Who is going to kill you already took birth. Kongsu was again very, very nervous because Kongsu could not realize how it's possible. I am checking all the time, very, a guard man is very strict. How it is possible? Up that Mahamaya going up and speaking. You are unnecessarily going to kill me. Actually, who is going to kill you? Already took birth. Then Kongsu Kong was very nervous. Kongsu was very feeling very nervous. But to do the girl gone and forecast that's going to happen. That girl gone. And Basudeva Kalananto Agroto Bhavita, you know, Bhagavan, you know, Swara, I already told you. So there the aerial boys, I mean when Brahma and all demigods going there, already speaking. First of all, Anantadev can appear to make the background. After that, Bhagavan giving instruction to Mahamaya. To Mahamaya. That all material people, they can worship you. Like Krishna, Durga, Katayan, you can worship you. They can worship you. They can worship you. So you can do this seva. You can first take the womb of Sankarsan, which to there, transfer. And after that, can take birth. As a sister of Krishna, Krishna speaking. But one point is very vital point here. That, that Maya is a Mahamaya or Jogumaya? That is the main problem. Is the Mahamaya or Jogmaya? Who can speak? Because Bhagavan Sikh is now already speaking, all material people, they can worship you to get, to get Kripa from you. All material people can worship Durga, Kali, you know, you can worship Saroda, Chandika, it is written, Bhagavan Sikh. In this form, all material people can worship you to get material, to, to fulfill their material desire. It is written. Vishwana Chakudu was speaking, that Jogumaya need not come for this small job. For this, for this very small seva, Jogumaya need not come. Why Jogumaya can? Jogumaya can only help, you know, to do different kind of secret lila, like rasa lila, everything, all arrangement, those gopikas thinking, we are married, but they are not married. All this conception. Mo ego, mo, ek, Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking, in Chaitanya Chaitanya you can find. Mo vishaye gopiganer upapati bhap. Mo vishaye about me, Krishna speaking, that about me, all those gopika thinking, I am outside hero. They have their other husband. They have one husband. And I am outside hero, lover. This conception is done by Yogumaya. Mobishaye gopiganer upopati bhap. Not porti. Porti means husband. Upopati means sub husband. Sub husband means actually hero, outside hero. 
they are speaking, Bhagavan singing. About me, those gopikas thinking, I am outside hero, they love me, I am their lover. Is conception, you know, they can feel by the mercy of Yogamaya. Rasa Leela going on for one Kalpakal. Kalpa, you know? Brahma Kalpakal. But they taught on a fraction of second, Rasa Leela gone. One fraction of second, Rasa Leela gone. Over. All done by Yogamaya. Vishwana Jagat, we are speaking. For this small seva, Yogamaya need not come. Mahamaya is sufficient. Mahamaya is sufficient. So, Mahamaya going to arrange this small job. To transfer this day to Yogamaya automatically. Vishwanath Chakoti was writing. So, this way Krishna was transferred there. And in the morning time, very early in the morning, Nanda Baba or Bhujavasi, they could discover, they could realize that our Yashoda is going to give birth to one baby. About Vasudev Daivaki, about Vasudev Daivaki, it is not written there that Nandatmaja. About Nanda Mara, it is written Nandatmaja. But about Vasudev, Vasudev Atma it is not written. We try to understand what is it. About Vasudev Daivaki, it is not written that Vasudev Vasudev Atma Jo. Atma Jo means Atma Jo means Atmani Jayate. It is Atma Jo. This honor is only given to Nanda Baba and Jasudama. Not even to Vasudev Daivaki. Atma Jo means. Atmaja mean? It means, I mean literal meaning. Atmaja mean? If Krishna is going to take birth from Yasudama, um, then we can say Atmaja. Though we know it is Bhagavan is eternal, uh, taking birth is one kind of meaning. Okay, but still this kind of honor is only given to Nanda Baba Yasudama, not to Vasudev Devaki. That's why we say Nanda Nandan Krishna. Not Vasudev Atmajo, Nanda Nandan Krishna. Nanda Atmajo, we can see this way. Anyway, after taking bath on the morning time, our, on the morning time, all Vrajavasis, including Nanda Maharaj, everybody, they discover that one small boy is there. Very like, you know, very Indra Nilmani. Very. Nice. Then there is shouting all Brajavasi chain wise. Because Brajo is such a place where chain wise. If you if you whisper in the, with the wall, the news can go like current. Brajavasi is so fast. Communication. All they're getting in the very you know in the very old age. Nanda Baba was all very aged, and Jasudama also very aged that time. Because before so many daughter taking birth and die, die, die. After that, they said. So all Brajavasis they started running to, to see the Nanda Nandan Bhagavan Sri Krishna. They are coming. And Nanda Baba also very happy. Nanda Baba so happy that we cannot speak. After that, Nanda Baba going to Jato Sanskar. Jato Sanskar, when a baby taking birth, is a system in you know, Vedic rules that one must call one barber to cut the neighbor portion. After that, you will have to call Brahman to receive. So many rules. It is a rule say in Vedic culture. So they are going to call. Finally, they are going to observe the birthday, I mean, Abhir Bhaktiti of, uh, of this Nanda Nandan Bhagavan Sri Krishna. It's a very fantastic festival. All Brajodham, they are shouting. All Brajavasis, they are going to throw milk and curd with each other, or butter, you know, taking butter and throw, and butter, you know, in a face. Nobody can know who is this. 
they are taking butter and throw in the face. So this butter, ghee, yogurt, all everything they are, they are throwing with each other, whole Brajabhumi become, you know, very sleepy. And Nanda Baba is going to arrange a big festival and going to donate, going to donate, you know, because when Nanda Baba was there in Gokuldam, in that case his treasure, treasure, you know, treasure, his treasure was there in Raya, Raya. Raya one place. When I am doing Churasikos, then I go via Raya. Then I go to Big Dauji, Bare Dauji. I, someday I can explain anyway. So, Raya. Raya mean? Rai. Rai mean actually Sampati property. So, Raya mean this is a place. When Nanda Baba is going to stay there in Nandagaon, then his treasure, I mean, was transferred to Koshi Kella. Koshi. Koshi Kella. And when Nandaba was there in Gokul, then his you know, treasure was there in Raya. So going to take all tre you know, money, property, everything, gold, ornament, clothes, everything and distributing among Brahman Vaishnava. Go. All giving distribution. Those Brahmana going to speak Vedic hymns and they are going to make some jagya, everything. And all Bhajavasi, you know them, their mood, always they are singing the glories of Nanda Maharaj, Yasudama, Rohini, uh, about Nanda Lala. They are singing Braja. In Brajodam, they are singing this song there. There. Nando ke Ananda Bhayo Jai Kanaya Lalki. Hati Dine, Ghoda Dine, A Dine Palki. They are speaking Brajavasi. Brajavasi like. If I explain, no use actually. And all the, in the starting he make disturbance. I wanted to speak so many things. All gone. Inside. So, Nando ke Nando Bhayo. Nando ke Nando Bhayo. Jai Kanaya Lal ki. Hati dine, Goda dine, Ar dine Pal ki. This song. They are singing or dancing. All, you know, Belon, you know, Belon. Everything they have said on. This way actually, actually, Prabhupada many times used to say that Krishna Abhirbhav should be there inside our heart. If we are going to ob you know, observe Krishna Abhirbhav externally, some fruits and flowers, we are doing so many decorations, this is not Abhirbhav. We'll have to decorate our heart in such a way, we'll have to decorate our heart in such a way, so that the actual Abhirbhava Krishna can be there. Many times I told, we'll have to invite Anantadev inside your heart. Otherwise, who can accommodate Krishna? Who can accommodate Krishna? If we are not, if, if we are, if we are not going to invite Anantadev, who can accommodate? Because Anantadev can accommodate. In the background of Anantadev, we can... In the background of Anantadev, we can keep Krishna. Krishna is on Hari Ananta, Hari De, Rupa Ananta. So this way, each and every time we will have to feel the appearance of Krishna inside our heart. If appearance of Krishna is not there, then surely you can discover Maya going to appear. There is no alternative. Either Bhagavan is going to appear, Adakshaja, Bhagavan, or Maya. There is no alternative. So, Prabhupada used to advise us that all the time you should realize the appearance of Krishna, Abhirbhava of Krishna inside our heart. Which is only possible when we can purify our heart like Vishuddha Satyam. Vishuddha Satyana, Satyasya Satyam, Nihitancha Satya, Satyatmakam Tvam, Saranam Prapanya. All demigods, they are coming 
to glorify the womb of Rohini Ma, uh, womb of you know the Devaki Ma. All demigods they are coming to glorify the wombs of Devaki Ma. Abir Bab of Nanda Nanda Krishna is very secret. Nobody knows. It is kept secret. For outside people, they have no information. Abir Bab of Nanda Nanda Krishna is such a secret thing. Even outside people, they have no idea. They only knows one thing, that Krishna took birth in the Kamsa jail. It's very secret. So all demigods, they are going to pray the ums of Devakima. Hey, they are speaking this way. They are going to speak. Athapite Devo Padambaya Dayo Prasado Leso Nugrihit Evahi Janati Tatyam Bhagavan Mahinmo Nacha Nacha Anyam Eko Pichiran Vichinmana. There's demigod speaking to Bhagavan. Bhagavan, it is not possible for it is not possible, it is not possible for anybody to realize your Abhirbhav, realize your Tattva. For infinity period, they can try. For infinity period. For infinity period, they can try, but they cannot understand. But when somebody is going to enjoy a little kripa of Bhagavan, Athapite Padambuja Dayo Prashad Lesha Onagrihita Evahi Janati Tatyam Bhagavan Mahimno Nacha Eko Opi Chiran Vichinmana. Thus, Jimmy got speaking. By personal efforts, by personal efforts, by infinity period, you cannot realize the Tattva of Krishna. Not. If you can enjoy some kipa of Bhagavan through Guru Vishnu, then it is possible. Padanjuya, Padambuja, Daya, Prasadale, Prasadmani kipa. By chance, if you are getting kipa, some actual kipa, then you can realize who is Krishna, why he is going to appear, what is the utility. First point is that he is Ananta. Bhagavan, we can accommodate Bhagavan in the background of Ananta Dev. So how it is possible that Bhagavan is going to appear in the form of a small baby? That's why Bhagavan told, Janma karma chame divyam jubeti tattva taha Takta deham punar janma noiti mamitu swaharjana Arjun, he need not take birth again. If you can realize the Abhirbhav of Nandanandan Krishna, Bhagavan Sri Krishna. This is enough. Anyway, we can go on glorifying, you know, the all different lila of Bhagavan. See, better Prabhupada used to say, eh, in Abhirbhav Titi of Krishna, we can go through Chaitanya Bhagavat. Prabhupada used to say. There is Abhirbhav Titi of Krishna, but you can go through Chaitanya Bhagavat. Because Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, same. Chaitanya Bhagavat, if you can go. Paran, you know, Paran can go on. Anyway, uh, I wanted to speak so many things, but diverted. So I like to stop my discussion here. Tadeva Ramam Ruchiram Navam Navam Tadeva Sashyat Manuso Mahasavam Tadeva Sokar Navasosanam Ninam Jaduttama Sloka Jaso Onugi Hatayam.